In this video, I'm going to show you how to remove exhaust drone. Let me show you the before and after. Ah, holy sh! It completely worked. <laughs> it completely worked. Oh my god. Are you kidding? So, the general idea for a drone pipe is adding a length of pipe perpendicular to the exhaust flow. Now, there's two ways you can do that, and I'll get to the length itself uh, in a second, but overall, what you want to do is as straight of a pipe as possible and as perpendicular or as against the, the exhaust flow as possible. So what you see there is a pretty good uh, break. You see a single exhaust all the way back to dual tips. That's what we're doing for this video. It doesn't matter if you have to clock it a little bit uh, you know, up or down, but as close to perpendicular as possible. That's gonna, be, that's gonna be the best thing for you. Now, you can do it at the beginning of the exhaust, the end of the exhaust. The earlier you do it, the better, but know that the temperature will change. It's gonna be a, a hotter exhaust gas the higher up in the exhaust flow you go. So you'll have to pay attention to that when you're, when you're finding your speed of sound value. Now, you can also do curves to come off perpendicularly, but again, this is gonna be a little le uh, less effective than a straight piece. Do not do it with the flow of the exhaust like I showed there, okay? What you wanna do is you wanna do it perpendicular, okay? Now, it, it comes down to fitment, so if you need to run a curve to fit it, do it. Uh, at the end of the day, you need to fit the pipe length, that's the most important part. So, let's, uh, let's dig into the calculation. So the calculations we're gonna use are the speed of sound calculation, slightly modified to factor in temperature, and the length of the drone pipe calculation, which uses the speed of sound, the RPM of the worst drone, and the pulses per rev. So we're gonna jump over to supernull.com backslash drone, and we're gonna use the built-in calculator here. So the speed of sound, you punch in in Fahrenheit, it'll give you the SOS, speed of sound calculation. You can punch that in. For this video, we're gonna use 380 something, 2500 RPM and 2.5 pulse per rev because it's a five cylinder and we're using a single exit exhaust. And that gives us a length of 36 or so inches. The link to the calculator is in the description. So based off our calculations, it was about 34 inches cold, 36 inches warm. So I've sort of gone in between and done 35, just general, you know, notched it up like I'll show you. Now I'm working on making a cap here out of some scrap stainless. For the actual bridge support, I have um, this and I could use that, but I'd rather use this because that's funny. It's a piece of a uh, stainless steel spatula that I have lying around. Okay. Quick, very, very official air leak test <clears throat> to check out that. See if we're leaking any air. You deburr it right here. Before we do, we're gonna get it in where we sort of want it, which is here. And I forgot how long this was, because it goes down all the way just about into the diffuser and wheel well. But if we throw it on a slant, we'll bridge it right here with the uh, scrap stainless that I've got lying around. All right, so check it out. <clears throat> First of all, I'm wearing safety gear and I'm using a guard because of a subscriber. And I'll put his name up uh, because, thank you, you're right. I should be better about wearing protective gear. So basically what we've got here is a cutout and it's going to come basically one side swoops more than the other you can see like that basically that's going to go in there I still need to clean up the edges but it'll be close enough and then sort of like that all right tacked on no bracing yet once we test fit and verify that it should work we have a whole wheel well to play with. There it is. Let's throw it on. Done. Oh, there it is. Founder. Grill master. wider like a lot all 
Alright, 25. <laughs> <laughs> Holy sh! It completely worked. <laughs> it completely worked. Oh my god. Are you kidding? Uh, should I go? I'll go Just go get something. We, yeah, get something. We, and it still kind of no. bubbled. Oh my god. The drone's gone. <laughs> it's completely. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Um, it's notably quieter though. From in the car, I wonder. We'll have to do an outdoor. Maybe let's go to the industrial area. That's 2600. Dude, that was in your head before. I'm like, a, I, it was really bad before. All right, I'll take it. 28, 28. It's gone. Nothing. This is this is a supremely drivable car. This is such a good thing to have in our bag. Holy, this is amazing. Thanks for watching guys, go straight pipe your car.